When we bought the place 23 years ago, it had been uh, just being hayed for about 20 years without anybody replenishing anything back onto the soil, so just take, take, take. And um, our um, strategy was to bring livestock in, so we did a lot of grazing, and then we were able to move into vegetables because the fertility came up. And then as we're getting older now, we got into fruit because it's high value. We look at our farm as a complete organism, and so we're not using any herbicides or uh, chemicals that are going to leach into the soil and destroy the microbes and fungi that are so important. And that's the base of the life with us at the top, <laughs> enjoying all the fruits and berries. We strive for biodiversity. This 14 acre meadow here is, uh, we've left it unmowed for the past five years. So we want you know, beneficial insects, we want to provide habitat for pollinators, for birds, so that we can have a natural equilibrium here. So having the ecological services of all these plants and animals here working along with us allows us not to spray any pesticides on our food. And you know, not that we never have pest problems, but when they do, they usually come back into balance pretty quickly. I think if you're observant, you know, take care of the soil to start as the basis, the plants are gonna take care of themselves. If you buy organic, then you're supporting people who are stewards of the land. 